Hello, my soccer universe. The Champions League is also starting up again, but we're still in qualifying. But you know, we are in the third qualifying round, meaning everyone who loses here has already the group stage of the Europa League secured, which in my case I'm really not happy about because of Rapid Wien. I know it's good for Austria, but I just hate them so much for what they did last season that I really wanted them to flame out. No, it's not gonna happen, they're gonna play Europa League group stage. Anywho, uh, here are the games that are happening today and they're actually quite, I don't want to say neatly separated, but we have a lot of Champions Path and we have uh, some other League Path and the League Path games are, I think, all the games that happen first on Tuesday. So these are not teams that were with Champions, but were uh, in second place and they have their own way into the next round. So we start out with an uh, interesting one, Dynamo Kiev against Alkmaar. Uh, not sure who I would favor here. Alkmaar has been great, but you know, Lask beat them easily. Kiev also kind of so-and-so. The big one here I think is Pauk against Benfica. Uh, I think Benfica are the favorites in Benfica. By the way, if you look at my Champions League uh, jerseys here, Benfica is the only one that I've hanging up there and literally the only team of those that I have a jersey of back there, the really old jersey. Um, I was about to pull it on, but then I said, no, they're playing against Pauk and I really want Pauk to win. So I decided on the Champions League jacket from Juventus that I have kind of fits the, the bill. Benfica favorites, but I think in a one-off uh, game, and these are all one-off games, Pauk will have a chance against Benfica and that would be interesting to say the least. And then Ghent against Rapid Wien. The Austrian supporter in me would begrudgingly hope that they move on on the other side. I don't think they will make it past Olympiacos in the next round. Uh, so why bother? Why give them more money? And I want Ghent to win. I'm not a patriot. I want Ghent to win. Also, they have the way cooler logo with the Indian head, and I think no one is crying yet there that this got to be changed. Um, now, in the Champions Path, we also have probably more dicey matchups. I mean, Omonia against Juventus Vesda. Juventus Vesda should be the um, fav favorites there, but you know, the Cypriot teams, they have been, uh, let's say, interesting in the Champions League uh, as of late. I think Ferenc Varos against Dino, Dinamo Zagreb. Dinamo Zagreb highly favored, I would assume. But the fact that this is Hungarian against Croatian champion uh, already makes this very, very intriguing to me. Uh, not something I could say about Karabakh against Molde from Norway. Or Maccabi Tel Aviv, Dinamo Press is only of interest for the Austrian because uh, one of those two will play against Salzburg in the playoff. And then Midtjylland against Young Boys. Of course, I want Young Boys to win. Young boys have a fan friendship with Lusk, so definitely they're gonna win. So this is what's come, come, coming up, and the winners go straight into the playoff round, where this will be a two-legged affair. We'll talk about that when that time comes. That's already next week. So boom, 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 boom. Everything happening really, really, really fast. Uh, I probably will watch the rapid game and let's see about whatever, whatever else I'll be able to see because that's not so clear at this stage. I really would like to see Park Benfica, but I'm not sure if I can see it here in Austria. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Let me know what you will want to watch from this. And yeah, uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more on the Champions League and any other league or you know of these jerseys here. And I will talk to you soon. Bye. Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, here are some videos or playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will keep you updated with all things that are rotating in my soccer universe. And with that, I'm going to wish you a wonderful day. Bye.